guys, welcome back to Man Stuff TV. Um, Ethan, Ronnie, and I, we're off to the woods for the afternoon, aren't we, yeah. Ethan? What are we doing, Ethan? Um, we're going camping in the woods, and um, I brought some toys just in case they got bored. There we go. So, see you in a minute. There we go, all set up, right next to the fire, which I've got to get going. So, and look at the state of that dog. Put the coat on her to try and stop her getting too wet and cold, and what does she do? Roll around in the mud and the fire pit. Yes. Don't worry, it's not lit. Yes, that's a naughty dog. She is, isn't she? Uh-huh. So we need to build a fire, don't we, mate? Yes. So most importantly, you need a a mate. What's she complaining for? <laughs> Is that right? Dad. Oh, okay then. Dad. Right, so what do we need then, mister? First importantly, for making the fire, you need an axe to do, get some wood, and then cut it down with, the, uh, with, with an axe. What else do we need? Well, we need um, these in here. Dad, can you help me a bit? I'm to help you with it, yeah? Yeah. Is this the little magic tin of fire stuff yeah. that Dave gave us? Yes. It is... Delta 2. He gave us all of this stuff yeah. in the awesome tin, the man stuff tin. Yeah, but do you know what I'm eating Pointless right bits and pieces kept in here. Well, sorry, but I won't fit in the tin. <laughs> um, do you know what? I actually, um, do you know what I'm eating? What are you eating? These. <gasps> you like those ones from Lidl, don't you? Yeah. And there. And we've got some more down here as well. There's some cheesy biscuits and some crunchy fries. Wait, no, Ronnie. Don't you Ronnie. dare go in there, Ronnie. Yours is the other side. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Ronnie out the fire, move this way, come on. Come here. Ronnie. In there. That's your bit there. Ronnie! Ronnie! That, ah, uh, ah, uh, stay. In. Ronnie, in. No, no, she's not having it. <laughs> what will I have to put up with? Ronnie, no! That's a yes, 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 yes. Oh, God. These are really naughty dogs. <laughs> Don't you shout at me? Hey, Gabby, quiet. Enough. No, not roll on the floor. Not on me feet. Ah, enough. Right, so I better start the fire, hadn't I, mate? Yeah, so first you need to pick pickaxe and start chopping. Pickaxe? No, it's just an axe. Yeah, just get the axe and start chopping down trees. Chopping down, I'm not going to chop down trees. I'm not chopping down trees. Right, we've got a bit of wood over there. We don't need a very big fire. So we're just going to take a little bit of the wood from over there. Because I put some there last week. So I'm going to take a little bit of the wood. We'll make a small fire, okay? All right. Did actually come here to uh, try and start a build. Uh, it's not going to happen. Not today. No chance. Too wet. He won't let me. He wants to play and stuff. So got his toys. He's happy now. What can you do? We got a little fire on the go, so I'll get some noodles on. Do you like your noodles, don't you? Yeah. Likes your noodles. And I'm sure Ronnie will polish off whatever he down eat. <laughs> Look at that, licking her lips already. She likes noodles. <laughs> oh well. Yeah, those, uh, I've been told those caravans there are going to be moved, so. so. 
there's our little uh, um, C3PO, Ethan calls it. Little Toyota Yaris, fantastic little car, cheap as chips to run. And parts of it are brilliant. Anyway, enough of that crap. So, there you go, it's our little camp anyway. Put it out. Not too bad. Throw it together with a couple of tarps. A couple of poles. <laughs> so, yeah, we got all of this. This is where I camped in the last video. Uh, the first part of the video. Um, reason I moved was because the wind was blowing all the way up here, right up here, cutting straight through. It didn't matter what I did. I, I, if I put a shelter on this side, whether I put it on that side, or on that side, or this side, or whether I put it on all of them, it didn't matter what I did. You, you just end up with a funnel of smoke that comes straight back in at you. So, it's, you know, don't keep fighting it, move. One of them. Right, so, I think we're going to call it a day at that, really. What do you reckon, Ethan? Should we do any more videoing or not bother? Uh, <laughs> we'll do some more in a bit there. See you in a bit, guys. There we go, lunch on the go. <laughs> you alright in there, Ethan? You having fun? Yeah. He's on my dinosaur. Oh dear, I'm running away from you then. Scary boy. Ah! Ah! Even the dog's scared. <laughs> scared I'm scared of that much she sneezed. Yeah. Several she, times. Yes, yeah, she did not wife. She's running her sneeze away. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've got to say, the three cooking items I use are just fabulous. That's the stainless steel pot I got from AliExpress for about a quid. That MSR tin is just phenomenal. I got that at a car boot, but I think you can pick them up for about 15 quid. And I believe uh, Zebra make exactly the same one. Maybe even Zebra and MSR are made in the same factory. I wouldn't be surprised, but... It's a fabulous little pot. I saw um, Carlisle 195, John. He was using one of those when I camped with him. And it's just, it's just fabulous. It is fabulous. It doesn't take up much room in your bag. You can put stuff inside of it, like food and, you know. I mean, that, that's where I kept the um, packs of noodles and stuff. So, you know, it all nests inside quite nicely. Um... And then that solo stove, the solo stove pot, the 1800, <coughs> that fits the um, the wood stove that I've got with the tran gear inside of it. Uh, that will fit nests beautifully inside of that with the man stuff tin that I've got there. So it, it all sits lovely together. It really does. It doesn't take a massive amount of space. If you've got a rocket pouch, you could you can fit that in a rocket pouch, and there's still room to put stuff in. So you know you can't go wrong. So what are you doing, Squidge? Get away from the smoke! <laughs> Why in my eyes? Yeah, it's not much fun, is it? No, it's not. Get in some wood, mate. Don't worry. Yeah. Well, you don't like it either. Pausing for the fall. Naughty step, knock fingers, make me fall over. Ah oh well, I'm sure you'll get over it. I hate that stone. <laughs> Hear it, I'm sure you'll get over it. No, I won't. Uh, I won't get over that thing, I'm going to chop it. Hang on, step over it. See, you got over it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I can't yeah, well, you got to watch where you're going, because, you, you look, you see the guy lines. You don't want to trip over them as well, do you? No. No, that would be good, you would it? You know what I'm going to do? Oh, no. Ronnie's found a stick. 
do you want to do? Oh, that's it. She's found a stick. She's going to kill that now. Do you want to do? Uh, axe. No, no axes. Not for you. Wood. No, you've been told before. No axes. in trouble. What have I done? I'm going to go and find somewhere I can stick out with no wood getting in my way. <laughs> <laughs> well, how about we go and check out the other camp in a bit? Yeah. Yeah? And start camping there as well. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we might take a walk up to the other one in a bit. These big things are getting in my way. Mm -hmm. I'm getting a piece right. of wood. See in a bit. Back. At my little camp spot. Yeah, this is my daddy's camp when I wasn't here with, with one e over there and just my dad. See? He's risen me right there recording <laughs> the video. <laughs> and it's, these yeah. trees just look like metal. They do a bit, don't they? So look a bit like rusty metal. Yeah. What are you kicking the tree for? <laughs> you nutcase. Isn't he barmy? There's the. Everybody on the fire. Wood, I've, I've left it there purposely so I could find it again. But I'm gonna actually dig a pit there. Um, everybody. Um, everybody on the um, video who's watching this right now, well, you know, I can actually snap wood. What? <laughs> You're a little hard geezer, ain't you? <laughs> yeah, I'm thinking there, I'm just gonna dig a nice, dig a nice little fire pit. Um, and then I'm gonna build a bench. Right about there or something. And maybe a bench there as well. Because I wanna leave that, 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 and that. Well, one, two, three. I want to leave at least enough room for three hammocks. So, which I reckon, if you've got some long huggers on that one, you can actually get four possibly. So, there we go. Wait, let me try it with this one. Not Welcome to Ethan Stuff TV. <laughs> <laughs> Ethan Breaking Twigs TV. Yeah. <laughs> Look at her, she's munching. She's munching that thing. She can't help herself. Yeah. She right, let's take a walk through the woods. Come on. Well, Ethan, well, come on. I'm going to bring my stick with me. Bring it with you then. But you can see everybody. how dense this wood's everybody. actually is. Everybody. Really good. It gets really buggy down that bit. That bit's like a swamp. Back everybody. there, it's not too bad, but it's hard to get into. Um, everybody, my stick actually got a bit broke. Oh, well. Go on, keep walking, sir. Why? Yeah, this is all very Why? young stuff. My stick. But to be Dad. honest, she'd get loads of hammocks in there. Dad, right. she grabbed my stick. Oh, good girl. Well done. There's loads of uh, loads of dead wood that needs chopping up. Dad, you my stick. So, yeah, doing all right. There's somewhere, yeah, I think in them tree stumps there, there's a badger set there, right by where Ronnie is. I don't know if anything's. I don't know if it's active. Yeah. Ronnie, move. No, it doesn't look active to me. Yeah, do you know what lives in there, Ethan? What used to live in there? What? Looks like it was a badger set. Ronnie, here, now. A badger? A badger lived in there, I think. Or a fox. I would have thought a badger, though, it's a bit big for a fox. Well, I think it's the Linda. I don't think so. It doesn't look like much has been moving around here recently, so... Let's leave it alone, now. Come on. 
This is awesome. How many sticks do you need, mate? Two. Oh. There's a roll there for it. Dad. I don't know. Dad, oh well. Here's what it is. What did we just see over there then? Uh, we saw wild deer. Isn't that cool? Yeah. It's in a couple of deer. And look at her. She's such a knob. Oh well, if we see another wild deer, there might be loads of them so we can take, so we can make a video and show you one day. Maybe. Maybe. But you know what? My our dog loves chewing sticks. She does. She loves sticks. That's why if you choose this stick, if you choose this stick or this stick, that's why I want to just in case. Go Ethan. Ooh, ee, ooh, ah, ah, ting, tang, a walla walla bing bang. Ooh, ee, ooh, ah, ah, ting, tang, walla walla bing bang. Ooh, ee. Oh, oh, oh. That's funny. You had it right then a minute ago. Huh? Go on, try it again. Go on, try it again. Go on, go on. Oh, oh, Ding tang, wal wal bing bang. Yeah! Go on, keep going. Oh, ee, ooh, ah, ah. Ding tang, wal wal bing bang. Well done, high five. Respect. Good lad. Good, Good lad. We're off now. So, help me, Ethan, going home now. You can see mummy. So, did you have fun? What's your favourite bit? Playing hide and seek. <laughs> Get the dog. Stay to her. You're a mess, ain't you? Yes, total mess. Let us mess her the seat as well, so while she's on the floor. She's more comfy on the floor, to be fair. Right, so should we say bye byes? Go on then. Bye. Bye, everyone. Thanks for watching. <laughs>